to everybody joining me very, very shortly. We're going to um, welcome into the studio Ben Reese. Um, trying to find Ben on my system here, guys, if you can give me a hand. Found him. There we go. Ben, come on in. Here he is. Hello. Good afternoon, the Richard. one and only Ben Reese. This, gen this, um, this gentleman here doubles up. He's a double agent here. Not only is he our commercial director and responsible for getting together all the sponsors who have um, <clears throat> enabled us to bring you Harping by the Sea this year, but he is also a trade sponsor himself. And I can see behind you on your microphone stand there, a whole rack of flying Vs. Yes, indeed. Clips, all that kind of stuff. Um, tell us about what you get up to. Well, so first of all, I'm the guy who's been begging you to part with your money all weekend. Um, but it's, it's not about me. It's not it's not money for me. But uh, this is my opportunity to try and get some of your money for myself, I guess. <laughs> no. Um, so this is this is this is this is what I do, really. Um, I make uh, bullet microphone holders mainly um, for for people's bullet microphones, because there isn't really anything else out there. Uh, if you're if you're not wanting to play your bullet mic the whole evening when you're on stage, you want to put it down somewhere. I myself, I sing in a rock band. I'm only playing uh, harp on a few songs, and I wanted when I bought my when I bought my green bullet mic a couple of years ago. I thought, well, I need I need to be able to put that down somewhere where it's not gonna where it's not gonna fall off and get kicked around. You know, it's a it's an expensive piece of kit, and I didn't want it damaged. So. There was nobody. I had a look around, and I couldn't find a, a decent solution for um, for putting these on, on on a stand. So I made my own. I I made I made this thing, which I called the ammo clip, and that fits in there nice and snugly, and keeps your keeps your bullet mic on the stand. Um, that that was it really. I made that on a three D printer that I had, uh, and I also made I also made these V two heart launchers as well because I wanted to keep my my harmonica's nice, nice and neatly on the stand as well. So, this is uh, this is the stand I use uh, when when I'm gigging. It has a vocal microphone on the top, not a, not another uh, bullet mic holder, but but that's that's it as well. And I made this for for the green bullet, um, and people started people saw it and they started asking me for other things, such as uh, this one, which uh, which will hold a, an aesthetic JT30 type mic. Clips in and out nicely there. We've got one for the Bulletini mic here. Comes in and out like that. It's on a it's on a little um, bracket I call the special branch there, so it will tip backwards. And <laughs> otherwise, in the Bulletini, it um, this bit gets in the way of the mic stand. And we also have one for the the new Hona Heart Blaster HP52 that you saw Steve Baker uh, demonstrating yesterday. So that's a great mic. That's the one I'm actually using for gigs at the moment. Well, if there were any gigs, which there aren't, but so he goes nice in there, goes in with a nice satisfying click, won't fall out, absolutely secure. You're not gonna, you're not gonna waste your 200 pound microphone by dropping it on the floor. And finally, finally, we have this one for a sort of vintage uh, J, uh, a vintage. Uh, what is it? It's a uh, it's a Turner, uh, a Turner five two four. Is it or a plus two? I don't know. This 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 one actually used to belong to Richard. I bought it off him. Beautiful mic, very very nice indeed. The Johnny A special. Johnny A special, yes. <laughs> so that's that's that that's that's my that's my collection of uh, of uh, ammo clip mic holders that I do. Um, Where can people get hold of this? This one. So they. So <laughs> glad you asked me that, Richard. Thank you very much. You can you can come to my website, uh, which I'll just bring up here, where you'll also find you'll also find that uh, you can get yourself a very snazzy harping by the tea harping by the sea T-shirt. You might have been right the first time. I've got mine here. Look, <laughs> the harping by the sea T. <laughs> so you're harping by the C T-shirt here. You can buy, and you can also get uh, you can get your um, or the whole the whole range of uh, battle plan harmonica accessories are available here. There are there are bullet mic holders. There are um, harp holders that attach to your stand. There are hands-free uh, solutions for amplified hands-free, which I'll talk about maybe in a little minute. Um, and 
the beauty of this though, the beauty of this is that because I make all these things myself, I design and make them at home, I can make customized pieces. So most of the, most of the things I have here are things that people have asked me for because they couldn't find something that they needed uh, from somewhere. So they, they, they call me up or they contact me through the website and they say, oh, hey, Ben, uh, I'm looking for something slightly different. What can you do? And we have a, we have a little conversation and we, uh, we figure it out together. And then, it goes on, and then it goes on the website for everybody to benefit from it. It's great. Answered Ad Azza's question there. First of all, he says uh, the, 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 the items that you make are, are really well made and his, he's got one. His mic fits uh, the, the ammo clip like a glove. Uh, or vice versa. He also asked, uh, do you make mic holders for any mic? And I think you've kind of answered that. Yeah, I can do. The, 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 tricky, the tricky thing is that to, to, to really do it properly, I need, I need the mic in my hands. Um, I, have done, I have done a couple for some people who have said, oh, it's, you know, I did a, one for a, a, a small shell brown bullet that I did without having the mic and I just communicated with the, with the fella. Um, can't remember his name, but he said, "Oh, it, it's the same as a green bullet, but it's a quarter of an inch smaller diameter." So I just, I just adjusted it, and it was fine. And we can do, uh, we can do a, um, a couple of, a couple of back and forths. You know, if, if if a few different rounds of prototyping are necessary, that's that's fine. I don't charge very much money for design work. It's it's more of a hobby really than a business. So I, I enjoy doing it. I just you, really ask if folks are, are tuning in to Harping by the Sea um, on YouTube and on Zoom from all around the world. Do you ship to them? Yeah, we ship. We ship. I ship all globally. I think go to Japan and China, Australia, loads to America. Um, actually, if 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 you want something in America, an ammo clip in America, my advice was to be to look for it on Amazon because postage to America is just ridiculously expensive nowadays. Um, so, so you can you can find these things on uh, Amazon uh, in America and, and and Europe and on eBay as well. Um, yeah, so if you if you're in America, have a look on Amazon first would be my advice. I've got a, I've got my my V here, my V two. Yes, in fact, in fact, Richard, you 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 named the V two harp launcher because when I when I first made it for myself, I was coming to your harp surgery. Uh, month or once a month, and I said, "Hey, Richard, have a look at this thing I made. What do you think?" And I said, uh, "I love and he it. Said, Let me try it out." And you and said, like, yeah. oh, "That's called that's called a V two upload, Joe." You said, or something like that. So, <laughs> which I've subsequently tried, and uh, I love it because you can, you know, you you can have the harp you're playing in your hand for the song that you're on, and then you can have two more lined up, or if you're going to switch harps midway through really handy failing that i put the rubs for my um my cajun um rub board yeah yep. grab those out of the pod and and uh, rub away when when the, the time when the need arises so i really recommend these things they're they're absolutely fantastic. this you've got a whole stack of them behind yeah you. i mean i've got I, I use three regularly but that's only you know if i if i extend this stand out the top of the screen here you can fit you can fit five or six on there <laughs> It's a bit crazy. So there's an alternative to having a a a, uh, a belt round your shoulder. Yeah, but there is a there's, there's also there's also this big box as well. So this this particular box holds twelve, um, and that does have, that will you know some some little clamps will fit on the back of there. You can stick that on your stand as well. It's a, it's a bit more unwieldy, but it, it you know the, these these boxes have uh, four, six, eight, or twelve harp chambers uh, versus the the V2 harp launchers. But yeah, these are these are, these are these are really fun. I gather if people wanted to visit your website and order one at the moment, they may be in for a, a bit of a deal. Yes, yeah, so there is a there is a a special show discount, a uh, twenty percent off everything on my website except for the except for the charity T-shirts. Uh, and that yeah, so if you use if you go to the website and you enter the code HBTS harping by the C HBTS into into the shopping basket is is 20 percent off everything i'm thinking if, if i can find the button um i can show people that very thing so here's our here's our website if you go to our sponsors this page here you can see all the sponsors you just if you want to visit them you just click the relevant logo at the bottom here look one or two resources that we've uh, got available for you and down here battle plan discount code is h b T 
S, Harping by the Sea. So when you go to Battle Plan's website, visit Ben, put all your orders through there, put HBTS in the special code and um, or the code window and you'll get uh, the discount that he's mentioned there. Thank you for organising that, Ben. Right. One one last thing I want to draw people's attention to before I know we're running out of time now, but the, That's fine. the, go ahead. the these uh, hands-free harmonica solutions. So this is a this is a green bullet. It's the same as same as this one here, but this has a, a special adapter on it instead of the grill that allows it to attach to this. So this is called the bullet buddy. So this will go on there like that. This is this is hands-free amplified. Oh, I've got it upside down. This is hands-free amplified harmonica. So your microphone goes on there. Your harp goes in here. And that then will sit all together on the ammo clip if you want to play guitar at the same time as your amplified hands-free harmonica or not only that windows come up in front of my screen go away right not only that but it will also fit into a neck rack so you can have that easy amplified harmonica uh, on your neck but not only that this this one bullet body unit that will fit uh, which way around am I doing it? I'll put that down. So I've got a number of different adapters. So there's a, a JT30 adapter, or there's a Bulletini adapter, or there's an adapter for an SM57. Where's that? Uh, or an SM58 mic. I can demonstrate all these things with more time and uh, uh, well, perhaps I don't know, in the bar, perhaps afterwards. Would you be able to, I know you've got other duties as well, but I don't, maybe uh, people could visit you for, for a few moments in the uh, breakout room? Yep. I know that somebody's, uh, Fred's asking, he's in the, the US, whether the uh, discount code is applicable on Amazon there. That may I, be yes, so I have, I, have set up, I have set up the Amazon listings with a 20% discount code, which is good until the end of next weekend. Okay. And uh, the the code on my website is good until the end of the Easter bank holiday weekend. Well, folks, if you've got any more questions for Ben about battle plan harmonica accessories, you can email him through his website. You can visit him um, in our bar for a few moments right now. Email us here at Harping by the Sea. We'll be happy to relate all your queries to him and put you in contact. In the meantime, Ben, thank you not only for uh, harping by, uh, sorry, for Battle Plan Harmonicas, but again, all you've done to uh, keep Harping by the Sea um, in check and bring everything to fruition. So for both those counts, folks, please put your hands together and show your appreciation to the amazing Ben Reese. Thank you, Ben. Thank you very much.